The North Carolina Zoo tries to help visitors appreciate wildlife and wild places in many different ways. Certainly the living plant and animal collections convey important conservation messages as do the educational displays at the exhibits. But another way the zoo tries to foster a greater respect for the natural world is through art. In fact, the North Carolina Zoo has one of the largest major art collections to be found at any zoo in the country. The latest addition to that collection is a geyser exhibit located at the zoo's prairie habitat. Frank Valdez of the zoo's design division tells us more about the geysers and what they represent. The geyser represents an emulation of geysers in the wild. Geysers are pretty much specific to the Yellowstone National Park region of the United States. For the prairie overlook, we were hoping to get the uh, same kind of feel, the same kind of look with the, the bison and the elk walking across the back that you would have if you were at Yellowstone. Yellowstone National Park has an extensive photographic database that we use as uh, sources for our colors, for our whole presentation. The small ones generally go between two to eight feet in height. They fluctuate, they're running continuously. The main jet shoots 20 to 40 feet at a, at a pop and it comes on every five minutes or so. There's only a, like a thousand geysers in the world and most of them are in Yellowstone National Park. We want people to look at the uniqueness of geysers as a whole. And it's a natural phenomenon, it's beautiful, it uh, reflects a, a lot about the way the earth is built, how the earth works. The geysers have added a whole new dimension to the zoo's North American Prairie exhibit while conveying an important message about conserving water and all of our natural resources. If you'd like to learn more about the geyser or our other exhibits, please check out our website at nczoo.org. I'm Rod Hackney reporting for the Zoo Files, connecting your life to wildlife.